Hello friends, in this video I'd like to solve the following problem from the Baltic Way mathematical competition 1990 problem number 15. We wish to prove that 2 to the power 2n plus 1 is never a perfect cube for any non-negative integer n. So it's a pretty basic problem. Just write our number as a perfect cube and factorize k cubed minus 1. You should get a contradiction at some point. So give this problem a try and I will see you in a minute. So okay, so let's suppose, suppose that 2 to the power 2 to the power of n plus 1 does equal k cubed for some, for some positive integer k. Well, that means, that means that 2 to the power 2 to the power of n equals k cubed minus 1, but k cubed minus 1, well-known factorization, it's k minus 1, k squared plus k plus 1. Okay, and now we see that we have a product of two numbers, of two integers, which is a power of 2. And that means that that implies that both both k minus 1 and k squared plus k plus 1 must be some powers of 2. Okay, so you know what? Let's let's use it. Uh, so that implies that uh, for example, k must be equal 2 to the power, let's say, um, l plus 1, or some natural number l. But now, if you have that, notice that k squared plus k plus 1 is 2 to the power of l plus 1 squared plus 2 to the power of L plus 1 plus 1, and that is 2 to the power 2L plus 2 times 2 to the power of L plus 1 plus 2 to the power of L plus 2. And one more step, it's 2 to the power 2L plus 3 times 2 to the power of L plus 3. And now let's consider two cases. Well, if, if L is 0, then 2 to the power 2L plus 3 times 2 to the power of L plus 3, well, we have 1 plus 3 plus 3 is 7. It's not a power of 2. And if L is greater than or equal 1, then... 2 to the power 2L plus 3 times 2 to the power of L plus 3. Let's notice that this is even. This part is also even. But sum of two even numbers plus 3 is odd. So I, in either way, we can't have a power of 2. That means that 2 to the power of 2L plus 3 times 2 to the power of L plus 3 is not a power of 2. And that's a problem, because it should be for our equality to hold. So we have a contradiction. So in fact we have a contradiction, which means that... that means that 2 to the power 2 to the power of n plus 1 is never a perfect cube. And that closes our proof. Pretty elementary. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye.